Hello everyone and welcome back to the Paperless Movement YouTube channel. Today I'm excited for everyone who is using already Equiflow. Do you know Equiflow? Equiflow is something that allows you to combine all your tools into one tool to manage your time, to time block. That's something when we teach ICO inside the Paperless Movement membership that we love. And I know our co-founder, Paco Cantero, he loves Equiflow, he uses it every day. And in my opinion, the announcement Equiflow just did here was a missing piece and it gets closer and closer that I will start using Equiflow on a regular basis as well. I will show you when I show you this, the limitations and the reasons why I'm still not using Equiflow 100%, but as I said, our co-founder, he's using it at full time every day. He says he cannot live without Equiflow anymore. And this is why we dive into this and let you know about this. Okay, let's dive in. Oh, you see here some animations. What is it? Equiflow is now available on a browser. I'm using the Arc browser. The Arc browser is a game changer. That's a separate video, but this is the reason why you see a full screen here. So I just open this up and you see we are here on webequiflow.com. So if you have an account, you can now go to this website and you can access your Equiflow in here. And you see already, it, it says the normal things. We go through this what you can do, how you can connect your calendar and all this, and then ready to go. And there we go. Now we have the normal onboarding that we have in the desktop version of Equiflow as well. But that's really the missing pieces. If I want to manage my time in a tool, then I need to be able to access this from any place because I'm not always on my MacBook. So they have an iOS version as well of Equiflow and now the browser version. Browser to me is always key because you can access your browser from anywhere. So therefore you can access your Equiflow and your time management from everywhere as well. So you see, it looks exactly as the desktop version. We can move tasks onto our calendar. It blocks automatically our calendar. So when we go to the calendar, we see the calendar is blocked here as well. We have the other functions like the all tasks and the someday. And then we have the daily planning. This is also in here. So I can start beginning my review and I plan my days this way. And that's it. So this works. However, there are still some limitations in the browser version versus the desktop version, which they also mentioned in their announcement email. So you see here, the things that are still missing is notification, opening the command bar from everywhere, capturing web pages as tasks, seeing your day at a glance with tray menu. But of course, you cannot see this on top. Connecting your Gmail accounts, connecting your Trello accounts. So some integrations are not possible to connect on the browser version yet. And show or hide, Equiflow, go back to today. So these are functions that you are used to when you work in the desktop version. But to me, that's not so big issues. I just love to see that it's there now. And you see they implemented now the two-way synchronization with Asana. And that's exactly the point which holds me still back to use Equiflow full time in my setup. Because when I delete a task inside ClickUp, it doesn't get deleted here and it will clutter up my stuff here. So let's say I'm doing a video and I made a test, ta test task just for the video to show you guys something and I delete it. I have it in Equiflow as well. These are things that are not as I would like to. Therefore, I suggested already to look at Plixi, which synchronized with ClickUp and Todoist, and they have a very feature-rich two-way synchronization that works perfectly. And if they're able to implement more of these features, then I'm sold on Equiflow as well, because to me, there's also, and I agree with Paco there, it's so nice to plan out your day with the task because it's not just ClickUp that I have here. You can integrate your Todoist, Slack. So this, for example, is great when you just save a message on Slack, it will bring it into Equiflow and you can plan it out. So if somebody's telling you on Slack something that you need to do, then you quickly save this and then you can plan it out later on in Equiflow. This is amazing. We have Sapia integrations. You can even sync to Notion, Zoom integration and a lot more. Now I see they even have iOS reminders, but that's only through iOS. FTTT. That's the issue with Apple, right? There's no so much direct access to this. These are, I think, the most important for us at the Paperless Movement as we are using ClickUp, Asana, I'm sure a lot of people are using as well. And that's that. Here, 
just to show you we are in direct contact with Akiflow talking about improvements and all this because we are really big fans of Akiflow so here's the question where I tell them it's really missing that it's not a real two-way synchronization yet because tasks don't get deleted or getting updated when I remove them and bring them back and things like that and here we see hi Tom thanks for your suggestion this feature is already on our backlog I'm adding your vote so I can keep you posted is there anything else it sounds generic but be ensured we are connected with Akiflow in the back end we are together on slack talking about all the things and I keep you guys updated about all this so if you haven't already subscribe to this channel if you want to check this out it's available now already if you don't know what Akiflow is go to the description below where you will find the link to sign up and by the way if you're not a member of the paperless movement yet sign up for free it's free so come over and I see you next time Every